Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing uh, Mega Man Legends the Second. Yeah, so uh, we're after a man named Joe who seems to have plans for a dropship, not unlike her dad was working on. And uh, as it turns out, he doesn't have a working memory. And also, he went down this room here, and uh, he might be having a bad time. And that's kind of where we stop. Not really... Like, I, I didn't want to, like, get involved too much into something. And so now it's time for us to get involved. Uh, after lots of talking and cutscene story, this is where the action is. And it's inside this big old dungeon place. So, I'm kind of going around, maximizing my... Uh, Right, there's a lock on. This game really wants you to lock on. Uh, oh, there, there they are. Here's the baby parade. Uh, it's kind of showing up. There you go, little guy. So I'm going. Yeah, this is very easy to see. I'm just going down all the corridors before settling on a door to enter. It's just a decision that I'm making that I think makes sense. There you go. That's. That's how you shoot up at them eventually. There you go, there. I woke you up and you're shaking and you're like readying yourself to throw a little like a lightning ball, but then you're not. And then there's over here. Is that gonna lead back to the start? Maybe? I don't know. I'm trying to get a sense for uh, the shape of this place. That's a wall can be recognized by the fact that... Okay, yeah, so we got ourselves a big loop with uh, doors on each end. Can I, can I not, like, move on the map? Guess not. Huh. Yes, I want that on. Search. Okay, you gotta do that. So here, and yeah, and there's a here, and there's a here, and there's one in the middle, too. So, that's exciting, I guess. Beamy? Well, let's start here. Let's go in the middle. It's the first door you see when you get here. Ugh, and there's a little reaver bot that I just kind of bump right into, like, immediately. <laughs> High quality bumping. Alright, everything okay? Anything in the corner? Alright, well, hey, free chest. Here we go. Here we go. You found a little bit of money. Maybe this is why... Okay, a little bit more money. That feels super random. <laughs> Alright, sure. Um, let's go... What's that? That's the elevator I took to get here. That's when I went through here. I guess I want to go through this door first, because... Of the two, because it's the one I want to go. And then I'm going to go in the door in the middle last. That's the plan. Battle plan. Here we go. Something's gonna... Something, maybe. Alright, here's another chest. Anything else here? No? Alright, suspicious. And pinnings on the other sides. Very important. Found old hover jets! Oh, look at that. It's the ambush brigade. Truly a day without awakening. Oh, that's that sounds tragic. Alright. Get as much money as we can before it all fades away. Like, this is why there's value in these little, like, crystals is because they fade, like they just disappear after a while. I guess when you put them in a wallet, they'll stick around a little bit longer, but if you just kind of leave them there, yeah, they just eventually just go. Okay, anything, like, if you just press the lock on button when you end up at a place, you'll find out really quickly if there's enemies around. There you go, that's a system. It's the anti-ambush system. You don't need to be aware where where an enemy is to be aware where it is with a button. All right, he's going in the middle, and it's an elevator. We did it. We cleared a whole floor. Do you want to go to floor B3? Why not? Okay, yeah. So the like the initial cave was B1. It's just in B2. Just going lower and low. Well, hello there. Where's Joe? Oh, there he is. <laughs> hey, Joe. Don't go on. Too dangerous. There might be a ghost. Don't talk. You're hurt pretty bad. I can't do anything for you here. Taking you back to the surface. All for that idea? 
Why am I reading like that? I don't I don't know what's going on. Okay, there's there's the boss. Uh okay. Oh, so we gotta go destroy the boss. Alright, sure. Alright, mister. You're having a bad case of the faints. No, he's alright. Yeah. Wonder how much effort it is to tug that like massive metal arm. Maybe it's lighter than it looks like. Yeah, okay. So there's a reaver. Master Reaver. Oh, is he gonna steal this thing and then leave? Well, if he tries to, roll wouldn't be in the way, so it's fine. Hey, it's Woodman from the demo! How's it going, buddy? What? He has a big spike on his butt. I don't know what you're talking about. It's not a bee. He has significantly less boss than he had in the demo, I have to say. Whoosh, whoosh. But my oh my oh look at that he's hurting the butt and he's holding himself that's funny oh geez is that how you're supposed to fight him just kind of insult him by just being in his blind spot like that oh spike spike bag though that was gonna do oh maybe that's why yeah he has a weight attack okay oh man see I feel like I'm benefiting from the experience I had with the demo here that clearly gave me an extreme advantage and being not being afraid of a boss and just getting in there also I don't Joe I don't think this guy would have been that dangerous to the city I'm gonna be real I, I just kind of made fun of him for a few minutes for like even a minute for not a long amount of time but turns out if you you need to make him destroy key columns to get a secret super unlock weapon I don't know, we- this is during the era of really stupid super unlocks, right? The text went by at its own speed. I did not press a button there. Uh-huh. Roll is focused. Can we steal a giant- the giant mineral? Fractor, yeah? Oh yeah. To do the machines. But also, we can probably use it to afford everything we need to- to get the big, like, the, the dropship upgrade. This was never in question to me. Yeah! <laughs> I love the lo-fi trumpet! Low-bit trumpet, rather. Whatever, it's fine. And low bit rate. <laughs> Alright, we did it. He's shaking. He's sh He's just wiggling all over the place. That is correct. That's the plan. Oh, we gotta listen first, sorry. Mm hmm Holding that blueprint when they found me collapse outside of town. Hmm. Okay. That's, I mean, fair enough. That would be pretty weird. Uh ah. All right, well, that was quick. <laughs> hey, and we, and we got a refractor, all right. Uh, so this really was like a little bit of a tutorial intro zone. Man, just, though, they, they took a lot of effort to build something like really complete and coherent for that. Unless we're gonna be returning in the future, which is possible, like, I don't know. Well, that is ungodly generous of him to just do that give us that old thing but at the same time he does have like a budding family here maybe now he'll be willing to just work on his life here all right i will be careful uh-huh hmm sounds great christmas music is starting because this is the winter town 
One day I'll figure out how to open this door. Hey, we're here. I remember this place. Oh, and you can go back and visit him. Wanna visit 203? I don't know why. Hey. <laughs> uh, no. Where is the gallery? What is a gallery? Casual wear in summer. Long pants in summer? Forget it. Look at that frog, though. <laughs> I don't know what's up with that frog, but I love it. Alright, well, uh, that just happened. There's a gallery. Are we even in the same town? Yeah, I recognize this entrance. There's a gallery here? Oh, I didn't go. Oh, no, that's the store general. I'm looking for ways... Well, maybe you can go here? Because there's the junk shop. Then, like, that's part of this building. Oh, and there's a general store, too, that I missed out on. Alright, fair enough. Here's some oil soil! <laughs> this side up. Oh, that's fun. In the freezer, and here's some food. Put a potato! Alright, the hoodle. Look at that. It's my old pal, but I forgot about him, and also I never met him, because that's a different person. I want to... Yeah, I am. Oh, what? Well, that was aggressive. I mean, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna push it, but... Did not expect that sour welcome, considering how, like, well I was welcome in the first game. But hey, we got the junk shop, though. Alright, let's shop some junk. Can... Whoa, alright. Yeah, I'm curious. Ionic parts raise my health. And this is a way to restore my health. And that is a way to heal special damage. Hmm. Obtains data on avoiding electrical current. I'm right, not... And what about parts? That is... things. Guards against knockdowns. Pretty good. This sounds like something I want. Much obliged. That seemed like something I'm also going to want. Oh jeez. And how about my items? That seems like something I'm definitely gonna want. And then I'm gonna be able to... Afford a roller board? Yeah! Alright, here we go! I spent all my money. I'm smart. I'm a little short. Alright, okay. So I'm not canceling. I can recharge, but I'm not going to. Alright, so now I gotta spend some time here then. Alright, item. Key item. All of those. Item. You can use it. To okay. Uh, huh, huh. But put these together, huh? And we might get something going. All right, equipment. I got all this time. I had the aqua blaster. Oh, well, these are the ones I have. All right, got it. Understood. Body part. Nothing. Armor. Nothing. Okay, so good. Buster parts, though. I got myself a power razor, and also put on a range booster. That's nice. All right. Okay. Here we go. Everything could ever need. Oh, wait a second. Did I not buy, like, a bio-health thing? Did- yeah, I did. Was that just, like, automatic? That's this. This is this. I mean, it's not... Yeah, it's not, like, anywhere. Was it used automatically? Is my health bigger? I cannot... I genuinely cannot tell if my health is bigger or not. Well, if I didn't do something that I had to do, I'm sure someone will be glad to tell me all about it. I'm just... I hope I'm... I'm I, I went through everything there is. Like, I can't imagine what I could be missing. I don't need to save now. Let's talk with Roll. Let's find Roll. Is Roll here? Like, she probably is outfitting the flutter as we speak, right? Hey, it's my room. I can tell because it says M. That's what that means. Check it out. Hey, it's a little bit less Spartan than before. You got a cactus. 
Got a clock. Yeah, it's an antique clock. I mean, it's good that it doesn't chime, because otherwise it'd have a chiming clock chiming in your ears while you're trying to sleep. Very smart. Okay, so this is the exit. There's the navigation room. Yeah, that's where the wheel can be found. Hey, and another copy of data. All right, this means we can get the Forbidden Island 2. Okay, sure, okay. Bring out drop shot. Not going yourself, are you? Oh, Mega Man is saying that. <laughs> you should have put a colon. Man, I'm worried about Gramps. Mega Man, that's me. I'm the one saying that, okay? Me, Mega Man. That's not true. We were driving it the other day, right? Weren't we? I forget. But why don't we go together? But, but you're... N yeah, we should go together. To me, that was never a question. <laughs> uh, Alright, you know what? Let's save. I'm gonna do a sideways shuffle. I'm gonna shuffle some more. And I'm gonna shuffle... Whoa, that was not a shuffle. That was a full run. Let's save and let's start tomorrow with that. Like, that feels like... Yeah, I'm energized. That just feels like a good idea. So maybe a little bit of a shorter episode today. But there was a lot of action. Roaming empty hallways. Whoa. Whoa, very exciting.